Yo, what is up everyone? Who is he here back in with another video? In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys this new method uh, to exploit on Roblox 64-bit so you don't have to do all that UWP stuff. Um, this method is kind of funky, I'm not gonna lie. It's, uh, it's weird pretty much. It uses cheat engine. It's a cheat engine hack and it's not level 7 like kernel or synapse or script where we're. This is really just a level 2 executor, not like internal executor. But it can execute very, very basic scripts like infinite yield and dex for basic exploiting like speed, fly, everything on uh, Bifron Bypass. So uh, let's get right into it. So before I show you guys how to download, uh, I really appreciate if you guys drop a like and subscribe on the video. Uh, yeah, you know, kernel is discontinued and all, but make sure you guys have post notifications uh, enabled when you subscribe so that you can get news. Like if anything does happen with kernel or any other thing. A bypass is found. I'll literally be like one of the first person to try to make a video on it. So if you guys could do that, I'd really appreciate it. And uh, let's get right into it. So first thing uh, you're gonna want to go to is the link in the description. Um, you're gonna have this right here. It's made by the guy who made Rune, which is uh, one of the executors that might be coming out for Bifon. But it's gonna be this right here. There's a lot of scam versions of this. Uh, there's a lot of legit and scam versions of this, so make sure that you guys aren't getting scammed with some like with some virus. Uh, there's other ones like the Netflix version and stuff. I don't even know how to use the other one, but uh, just click this. Make sure you actually have virus and threat protection disabled first. So go here and then go to manage settings and make sure this is off. So then you're gonna want to go to buy uh, right here and then just click save. It's gonna download, it's gonna say suspicious download, click download suspicious file. Pretty much same thing as uh, with like kernel we are devs. Literally the same process. So I'm gonna open it here and I'm gonna click extract and then click OK. And then it'll be extracted to my desktop right here. So now to get into the actual exploiting part. So the thing is with this, it doesn't work on every Roblox game, so it works on a game with tools. So I say like 80% of Roblox games this works on because a lot of games have tools. If you don't know what I mean by tools, I'll show you. So I'm gonna go into this game right here. Uh, you have to go to this game by the way. So I'm gonna leave this in the pinned comments or in the description. Uh, you have to go into this game. You can't just join any Roblox game. So you have to go to this game, right? And you'll have a tool right here. As you can see on the bottom of my screen right here, you'll have a tool. The tool has to be either in your backpack or in your inventory, preferably your inventory. And then you're gonna wanna copy the game ID of the game you're trying to get into. So right here, uh, I say Prison Life because Prison Life has tools. It's just really fun to exploit on. And uh, I'm gonna hop into the game, right? Well, actually first, before you do that, uh, this is the file right here. Uh, you're gonna wanna run rune underscore ce, which will prevent you from getting an HWID ban by uh, Bifron. But you're, you're all supposed to do this before the, I got into the game, but it doesn't really matter. So I pressed enter, and then uh, now I'm here. If you don't want to do this, you could literally just um, you could literally just click Robux or a scam. So don't click inject yet. What you're gonna want to do is go into the game, hop to game. So now I'm in prison life, right? I'm here with hope. So what you're gonna want to do is uh, go here. So this actually might crash a lot because uh, it, it, it isn't like fully like functional, but it still like works like basic stuff. So you're gonna wanna go to Roblox and click open. And then as you can see, I'm here. And then you're gonna wanna click execute. Or is it inject? You might gotta give it some time. Yeah, so it's gonna do this, and then click execute, and then wait. For, you might have to equip the tool. Alright, yeah. So I equipped the tool, and now here's the internal executor, right? So this is actually really interesting. So here are the scripts that it can download, that it can run. As I said, it's only very basic scripts. So I'm gonna copy this, and I'm gonna run infinite yield right here. G underscore I Y. As you can see guys, I have infinite yield. So if I do speed 100, I'm literally hacking with Bifon right now. Like, 
I could also open up my task manager and prove that this is the web Roblox. Here we go. No, not that. Here we go. Roblox game client, 64 bit. He said, How? See, bro, this guy doesn't even know the methods right here, bro. That's why you gotta be subscribed to the current channel. So I can also run uh, Dex. Genius for Dex. Who is he? I mean, you're cool. You're sick. Alright, bro. I don't even know why I said that. Uh, I might have ran this wrong. Alright, there we go. So, guys, I literally have Dex and Infinite Yield open. Uh, I don't think this doesn't have a decompiler, so you can't like view scripts and stuff, but. Like, this is still pretty cool, like, for a lot of games, you can still, like, exploit on just speed hacking, whatever. And there's also, these are the full scripts. Uh, so, by the time this video comes out, it might be updated, or maybe not. I'm recording this on uh, November 15th, and apparently the update is dropping later tonight, which is going to have uh, more functions and stuff. So, they have Lumber, Daikun, Cold Adam House, and Blade Auto Perry. So, these are uh, different games supported. But Infinite Yield and Dex work on uh, any game with tools. So uh, if I wanted to run this right here, uh, this Prison Life script, as you can see here, I literally have this whole Prison Life script, guys. Um, let's see. Auto fire. I don't even know how to run this, not gonna lie. Uh, <laughs> Guns, let me try this. Gun. Commands, all oh, rapid fire, armory. I'm not even sure how to execute this. Oh, okay, there we go. So you gotta just type that in. There you guys. Uh, I it literally just took me to this thing, so okay, yeah. So all right, there we go. I didn't know how to get it working for a moment, so just type in this little prefix thing, and then and then after that, it'll take you there. So you have to put in a semicolon first, but. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much how you do it. Uh, I'm gonna try doing it on a different game to showcase that it actually doesn't work only on Prison Life, but other games with tools as well. Alright, so I'm joining the script test game once again. You have to join this game before you join other games. Uh, cause you have to like teleport into them. And then I'm gonna actually copy the, the Lumber Tycoon first. I don't know if this works on Lumber Tycoon or Lumber Tycoon 2, whichever one. But, so I'm gonna paste that there and then I'm gonna run this. And then wait for it. Uh, I'm in the Roblox game. I'm gonna press enter. The, sometimes you press enter, it still doesn't work. So I'm gonna just close this because I really don't wanna. Wait, all right, so I'm here in this thing. Hop into the game. I am in Lumber Tycoon. I never played this game. I'm gonna uh, do this. Roblox open. Oh, I think you gotta inject this. And then, okay, yeah. Let it do. All right, so just uh, update on this part right here when I was editing it. So uh, the reason it was erroring, I'm pretty sure, is because um, it, I didn't have a tool equipped. As I said, you have to have a tool equipped. But I'm pretty sure if you had a tool equipped and then you ran it, it would have worked. But honestly, I never played this game. So I'm not going to go through the trouble of grinding just to prove that it works. But you guys can literally watch other videos on this like this uh, bypass thing. And uh, they showcase it in other games like Lumber Tycoon and uh, the other parry game that I had the script running for. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video, guys. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Uh... If you have any questions about this, 
uh, in the comments. You guys can ask, and I'll try to, I'll try to reply to them. But I didn't make this, and I'm not, I'm not a staff or uh, like a helper for this product, so I really don't know about the errors and stuff. If you do, then I'll talk to the owner and try to get back to you guys in the comments. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, peace out.